Hi everyone, and welcome to another episode of Star Wars Jedi Survivor. So, we are here on Koba. Exploring for... Information about Tanalor. I'm trying to make it into these ruins. I think I've got it this time. What's happening? You got me. Ah! I sure did. I'm glad you noticed. How? You can move. You can get mauled by uh, these dudes. Yes, so we're here on Tanalor looking for information. No, we're here on Cova looking for information about Tanalor. That's what we're doing. I begin to worry for this project. It is not our place to question. Well, even the Padawan sends something amiss. Well, that's not good. What's amiss? I gotta get in there. How do I get in there? Why do you guys always hide around corners, huh? Elusive. It's like they don't want a straight up fight, they just want to go and hide. Right, what's down here? How do I get you out? Welcome, Jedi. Enemies of peace threatening the galactic frontier and our Republic. Once we cross the abyss, Tananor could be a bastion to repel that threat. A beacon for hope and justice across the Outer Rim. Tanalor was more than a mission to her. It was a dream of a better future. Hmm. How then do I get this out? I know how I get myself out because I can go through here. But that thing can't. Ah. Is there anything up there before I send this? Let's get this data disk back to Z. Glad I checked now. Turns out, there was indeed something up there. Wedged good enough, I think. Be caught though. Can't make it, it doesn't stick to glass. Can I move this one? Nope, can't move this one. Hmm. Alright. Well, I'm not going to worry about that too much for now. Can 
Might have just jumped up there. That stuff just isn't in the way. Okay. Maybe it already got burnt by the by the beam. Oh, new perk. What else is in here to I would have been convinced you had to get rid of the stuff by the waterfall as well. But I don't see how. So let's carry on looking around in here. What took you so long? I came as fast as I could. My master is insistent. Well, you don't have to worry about that. Not back here. This isn't where I'm supposed to be going, is it? No, I do need to get rid of this, because I need it for the... I need it for that beam. So how... Well, I can't move the beam. Do I get it over there? Do I have to do it? For, no, because this side. This is behind the beam, so surely this won't do anything, right? Yeah. Ah, hang on. Hang on a minute. My brain has an idea. I suppose. Why is it just not? Why is it just not spreading on that? I did not expect it to make its way over this. I was trying to go up and over. So apparently I could have just gone like straight across there and it would have worked fine. No, pull it, don't push it. Quick look, see if there's anything else I can hit with this one. Doesn't look like it. Always worth checking, though. Time to go. Let's search inside. Let's just meditate and rest first. Back to it. Quick, 
quick look around outside before we go in. There's definitely someone to fight in there. Alright. Let's go fight whoever this is. How is none of this affecting their stamina all of a sudden? I was on my way to... Oh, God, I'm nearly dead. I was on my way to stunning them. And then suddenly, it's just going back up and there's nothing my attacks are doing about it. I was mid attack, so I couldn't dodge that one. Right now, like it's just going back up. Even though I was still attacking them. So either my attack should have been doing stamina damage or damage, or it should have been. Because even if they block, it should do stamina damage. Hey, BD. Come on. I pressed dodge. Was I still just in an animation? It's just a really long animation? I don't know. Another raider with a lightsaber. Dagon must be sending them out for something. And we're following the same trail. This thing's got your name all over it. I did wonder how the Raiders had lightsabers. It would make sense if it was Dagon that's doing it. But how does he know where stashes of lightsabers are? Did he have more than one? That would be unusual. No getting through. Another one of these devices. This one's broken too. He is coming. Destroy it now. Santari. Another of Santari's devices. That can kill Jedi for destroying it. I think this could be our answer. Let's bring this back to Master Cordova. Won't be locked for long. Let's take a look. I think Master T'Pol had this one. So we're going back to Cordova. Didn't expect to be returning there so soon. Hold them back. Look out. I can't. That window leads back outside. We should take this back to Jetta. Master Cordova will want to see what we found. Okay. I was just looking to see if there's anywhere else I could go here. I'm going over here. This looks like our fish dude. I'm 
sure Z can decrypt this for us. Okay, so those things have data disks. I finally just decided just to attack one of those things. And it turns out that was a good idea because they contain data disks. So, now I found the fisher. Do I get fish by eating, like... Sorry, dude. Watch where you look, laddie. The frightful reef fish is known to stun his quarry with a blinding flash of light. I guess you have a plan, though, right? <laughs> Cal, you, you kindly lover. Ah, sometimes I forget you only have cooked around the gills. The reef fish has attracted less kindly fishers, however. What? I know a noble who deigned to keep one as a pet. By greed, huh? Huh? Oh, 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 I... <laughs> Good one. Aye, indeed. Yeah, all right, that's enough. So that's how I get fish. I get fish by exploring and finding the fisherman places. And. He catches the fish, and they go in our fish tank. That's pretty cool. I like that. Can I make a quick detour? Thanks for the assist. Hey, what are you doing here? Can you lock on to him, please? That's not what I asked for. I was not pushing L3 down. But whatever you say, Carol. Wrong thing. Carol. Cute. Get out of here. Nice my data disk. Let's take this back to Z. Let's go, let's go. Why is this a war on war? I'm confused. You know what I can do now? Now that I think about it. I'm up here. I'm not in combat. 
Are you gonna make me kill them? No, no, no. Data disc back to Z. I found so many data discs around here, it is awesome. How am I getting out of here though? I suppose I need to get back over there and fast travel from the Is he gonna let me do this in combat? Good. Good, good. Now I can use this and I can fast travel back. Do High Loon Saloon, please. Bounties about you've already told me about bounties. But thanks though. So we're gonna go see Doma. Because I finally got ten pyrite, which means I can trade for the thing that I want. I have no clue what it's for. Well, I know it's for opening the door. But I just don't know what that does. All goods acquired completely legally. Thank you very much. I didn't doubt it. Yeah, some good for nothing raider triggered the security on my storeroom door and now it's locked shut. Maybe your little droid can use this encrypted backup code to get it open. We're locked out. My goodness, you unlocked it. Feel free to take whatever you can make use of. Why, thank you. That was super worth it. Another stim. Let's hope we don't need it. Then we certainly will need it. Many, many times. Um, but I will take Max. It. That was worth. That was definitely worth 10 pyrite shard. I thought it was going to be for that door. But no, it was not. Right, you didn't tell me there were new people to talk to here. So I'm just going to go see the bounty person. Because we know this is new. There he is. Got your first target lined up. Looks like some Hexian hack named Kip Oster has been slinking around Dredger Gorge. This guy likes to catch his prey off guard, so watch your back. Thanks for the tip. Thank me when you turn in his bounty puck. Be quick about it, eh? Oh my, I have something Cal wants. So you do abilities. Interesting. And blaster parts. That's cool. Don't want anything from there right now. Welcome, welcome. Make yourself at home. Head upstairs because I want to speak to Z. I also want to have a look at my fish tanks. If my fish tank is. Oh, let's talk to this dude. So, you wish to prick up your ears and receive the tale of Scuba? If you're sharing stories, we'll listen. Then you be a fool, my lad. A sordid tale will bring you nothing but grief and woe. 
okay. Well, if you're not sharing stories, we'll... Oh, fine, I'll tell you. At your own assistance. And at your own peril. My story begins in a small village on the frozen banks of Sakavi Tar. My home world. Nights black as quillfish in it. Winter so cold, a stern look can turn you to glass. Doesn't sound like the easiest place to grow up. Difficult, eh? From the moment your mother's milk froze on your tongue to the moment you found it upon frozen streets. You see, the fishes, they had the right of it. They dwelt far below the ice, where warm currents danced like ribbons in the wind. To fish so scarce a quarry, on account of the great fish famine, well, it's near a mild undertaking. But for all the belly aching now, there's a peaceful enough life for a wee Sakavian with an instinct for the rod. So you discovered your talent early? Such a talent was I, that as a lad, me hardly spoke to my first prickly chin hair. I was given an audience with Undan. But that'd be a tale for another time. I wonder if I have to come back, listen to his tale, before he'll move to his next spot. Oh, Cal, it's delightful to see you fully intact. Holding up okay? Fine, thanks. It's not the first time this frontier has been terrorized by marauders, you know. But once more, the noble Jedi Knights rise to the occasion. I appreciate the thought, see, but we should watch the whole noble knight stuff. Yes, uh, of course. I forgot I didn't talk to Zeke last time. Um, that could be a favorite. Should I get these first? I mean, that's kind of good to get early. It costs so much. Whereas we could get some cool colours for I'll BD. This will be useful. Excellent selection. What was that for? Trade twenty-five collected items. Forth, right. So now I'm just gonna meditate and save. And what we'll do next time is do the bounty, do the other rumours, because I've picked up some new rumours around here. So we'll start chipping away at some of that stuff. But for now, that is where I'm going to end this episode. Let's stop. And we will continue with that stuff next time out. If you enjoyed this one, hit the like button below. Or let me know what you thought in the comments. And join us next time for the next one.